Hello everybody, welcome to my channel and also welcome to this course Object Oriented Programming using Java. Myself Tanvi Rahman and in this tutorial I am going to explain how we can implement the strong and weak form of association. So there are two types of association, one is weak and another is strong. The weak form of association is said to be as aggregation while the strong one is said to be as composition. So in order to be very clear about the concept of aggregation and composition, let me show you an example of aggregation firstly. So you can see that there are two classifiers, one is car and another is wheel and the relationship in between uh, the car and wheel is aggregation because if the car is destroyed, wheel will not be destroyed or wheel may not be destroyed. So we can say that if the car is not working, then we cannot say wheel will not be working too. So the existence of wheel is not entirely dependent on the existence of the car. So that is the weak form of relationship and which is said to be as aggregation. So now moving forward to composition, we can uh, see another example which is about folder and files. And we can say that the relationship in between folder and file is composition because if we delete a folder, then all of the files inside of that folder will be deleted. So the existence of a file is entirely dependent on the containing folder. So this is the strong form of association and it is said to be as composition. So now I want to show you how we can implement these concepts in Java. So firstly I will be implementing aggregation and then I will be implementing composition. So in order to do that I am going to Eclipse and then I want to create a new project for that. So I am going to provide a name which is association here and inside association project and inside the source package I want to create a new package and I want to name it as association. So inside association package I want some classes so the first one is car and the second one is wheel uh, wheel so inside wheel class uh, I can uh, have some fields like uh, public string uh, let's say manufacturer manufacturer okay and then public double diameter and we can uh, declare a constructor like this public will and the constructor will require some double value to be uh, to be passed so double a uh, diameter and we can initialize this with our diameter so this dot diameter is equals to a diameter so now uh, from the car class as we can say that car has wheels so uh, firstly we need to have some uh, fields of the car itself so public uh, string name and then public string color color and then public string model and now as car has wheel we need to uh, declare a private field of wheel of the type wheel and the object will be wheel too and now uh, I want to create a new constructor here so public car and inside car I want to pass the I want to pass a, an object of a wheel so wheel a uh, wheel and then I want to initialize this dot wheel with a wheel so you can see that the car is performing its function with wheel but wheel is not an internal part it can be replaced or may be replaced with a new one and now we can run it and uh, to do that we need to create a new class which will contain the main method and I will uh, name it as program and then inside program class firstly I want to create an object of the wheel class so wheel a uh, wheel uh, sorry a uh, wheel is equals to new wheel then I have to pass a parameter let's say 100.5 and now a car class so car a car is equals to new new car and then inside the constructor of the car I want to pass the object of this wheel so that is how we can implement aggregation and it is the weak form of association now how we can implement composition so in order to do that so we need uh, two more classes here so the first one will be folder 
and the second class will be file so inside file class I want some fields like private let's say private string title private string title and then private string uh, let's say type and then private string uh, let's say size and now as they are private we need to provide getter and setter method so how we can do that public uh, let's say public void public void set title set title and uh, a string a title and inside of this uh, setter method I want to set this dot title is equals to a title and we can get it uh, by writing a getter method like public uh, string get title and this will just return this dot title this will just return the title and I'm not creating the uh, getter and setter method for the rest of the variables you can create it by yourself so now uh, from the folder class I want to create some uh, fields of folders like uh, public uh, string it can be the title of the folder title of the folder and then I want a directory so public string directory so now uh, inside a folder class as uh, we are implementing the concept of composition which means folder will consist our folder will contain files and it will be uh, the files will be an internal part of folder so in order to do that I am just declaring a variable called private file 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 and inside the constructor of inside the constructor of folder I will create the object of the file so public folder and inside folder I will create the object of file is equals to new file so uh, that is how it becomes the internal part of, of the this folder class uh, which means uh, the files lives and dies within the folder so now I can set a field set title uh, with a dummy title and I can uh, let's say the value is Java okay so that is how we can uh, implement composition and now uh, from the program class I can create an object of a file and then I can I can pass that particular file to the folder so in order to do that I can write file file is equals to new file and then and then folder folder is equals to new folder new folder so uh, that is how we can uh, creating a folder and inside the folder the files is Java but uh, from the program class we are not setting any kind of uh, title or any kind of thing of file so if I cannot create an object of file it will not show an error so that is how it uh, it hides all of the implementation details which means it is totally encapsulated by the folder class so that is how we can uh, you can we can implement the concept of aggregation and composition in java thank you for watching this is tanvir rahman signing out